Hello everyone, I will be showing you how to install custom weapons or user created weapons or stores for short as I will be referring to them from now on. User created stores come in a .json file. As you can see here, I'm about to use a user generated GBU-15 bomb. As you can see, I've got four of them on. Bomb has been dropped. It is a laser guided weapon, so in this case, it'll go to the selected target and kaboom took them out just like that. So we're going to go ahead and close the game here because any editing of a loadout requires that the game is closed. So once the game is closed, let's go ahead and open up our discord here. This is the tiny combat modding, com tiny combat arena modding community discord. Inside the discord, we have a weapons, uh, custom weapons file our custom weapons chat, I should say, which has a bunch of user created weapons created by some of our lovely community members here. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be grabbing one of the recently uploaded weapons, which in this case is a B61 nuclear bomb, a tactical unguided nuclear bomb. So we'll go ahead and download the .json file. Um, once it is downloaded, we will go ahead and give me a second here. Show and folder, there we go. Once we have the file, we are going to go ahead and open up arena data under our tiny combat arena folder, streaming assets, data, stores. And now because this is a bomb type weapon, we have to go to the bomb category. We will then drag in our bomb into this category, open up the file and the name of the bomb is listed as B61. So we'll simply copy B61. We'll go back here now from our bomb over to our data folder. And just like with creating a custom loadout, we'll go ahead and grab our AV8 here. We'll use the custom loadout that I was using there, which is the four GBU 15s. I'm gonna replace actually one of my AIM 9s with the new tactical nuke. Simply go ahead and save the file. We'll now boot up Tiny Combat Arena one more time. Quickly hop into the arena demo here. Start our sortie, open up the weapon loadout. And if we go to custom, we should now see that we have times one B61 nuclear bomb. The recommendation that I saw for this was uh, get away from the explosion. As you can see, it has the same model as the other bomb. That's just because it is a user generated weapon. So once we go ahead and get in the air here, we should have a little better luck. So let's go ahead, climb up. Oh, if I, uh, okay, we're going to retry that. <laughs> That's on me. This uh, aircraft, as you can tell, is just a, a little bit heavy now that it's carrying a uh, nuclear bomb. Just just a wee bit heavy. So we'll get as much speed as we can. Going down the runway here. Engage in our vertical thrust. Just kind of let the aircraft pick up some speed as we go. Pitch up just a little bit. Just keep that airspeed climbing. We can put our landing gear up now. And now we are at the point where we can go to regular transition to regular flight. But we still got our GBU 15s. We are going to go ahead and drop the tactical nuclear bomb onto that entire formation over there. And we should see an absolutely massive explosion when we do. Let's just climb drop it, turn, and run the hell away. Because I have a feeling it is going to be a very, very big explosion. All right. The targets are now all set. Dropping the bomb. Bomb is on the way, as you can see there. We are just going to fly as far away as we can and hope we don't get caught in the blast radius. There, it's about to hit, and kaboom. Anyways, if you enjoyed this tutorial, please do consider subscribing, and please do join the uh, the Tiny Combat Arena modding Discord. A link will be in the description. Hope you had a wonderful time. Hope you learned something. As always, have a good one.